spot that I came back to that looks completely different. And I ain't gonna lie, I shot this thing last week when I found out my original spot was closed. And this will be the second time I've shot it, because I shot it at gun range. I just couldn't resist waiting that long. So let's go ahead and show you guys my new revolver. It's a Ruger GP100 in 357 mag. Start out with the single action. Had to reposition my camera there, but we're gonna start out with the single action, which I already cocked back. Now double action. Try single action again. Oh, and I knocked the log over. Well, let's get it again. Okay, so this is my first revolver, and I was really excited to get it. So, of course, I had to go and buy some speed loaders for it. And I found these on Amazon, these HKS brand speed loaders. They're only $7, and so far, They've worked great for me every time I've used them. And I really like them. Alright, so let's start out with single action again. Another single action. Do a double action. Oh, that was way off. Yeah, that single action definitely makes a difference not having to pull the trigger to pull the hammer back all the way. Single action, my first single action shot was there. And then that was my first double action shot. And then that was my second double action shot. And then another single action, and then another double action. So not too shabby. I love the sights on this thing, they work great. Okay, so now we'll try some 38 Special. Single action. Ouch. I'm glad that wasn't 357 mag. <laughs> Always wear your ear protection. Let's try that again. Okay, so I've never done a mag dump with a revolver before. Is it still called a mag dump or is it called a cylinder dump? Well, I've always wanted to do this, so let's see how this double action really is. It's pretty fun. <laughs> So another thing I wanted to film was I got some big bore rounds. I think it's Big Bull is the brand name. These are supposed to be really heavy loads for bear protection and stuff like that. So I'm going to go ahead and shoot these off next. Yeah, those are definitely a little heavier of a round, that's for sure.
357 mag. the Ruger GP100. It's just a joy to shoot. I personally thought a 357 was going to have a lot more recoil than this, but from what I've heard, this is considerably heavier than most revolvers. The barrel is weighted down, and I think the overall weight on it is about 40 ounces. I'm not 100% sure what the average weight is on other revolvers, but from what I've heard, this thing absorbs recoil like it's nothing, so I'm curious to see if Ruger has a 4.4 mag similar to this that would handle the recoil nicely. Well, I'm done for the day. I'm heading back down the path. I got over a mile hike downhill back. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to give me a like, and have yourselves a good week.